middle of nowhere, in the middle of highway. I don't know if we will be able to keep going or if we gonna be waiting here for resolution. I think we'll be fine. I think we'll be alright. Oh, All right, so we just arrived at the floating mall. What floating mall. Um, Ampawa Floating Market. What is it called? Ampawa Floating Market. Okay, so we just arrived at the floating market. The town of Ampawa was considered to be an important water transportation hub of Samut Sankram province from the mid 17th century. Ampawa was also a commercial hub with a large floating market and waterfront community. Located about one and a half hours outside Bangkok, depending on traffic, today the floating market has become a popular tourist attraction. The main draw is seeing and tasting the variety of seafood and snacks prepared in and around the river. Yes, I said in. Some vendors fire up their walks and prepare their dishes directly in wooden boats docked along the market. Trying the fish cakes, deep fried. Let's give it a shot. Mmm. Oh my god. It's so juicy. So you don't taste a lot of fish, but you can tell it's fish cake. I'm gonna go for one more. Mm. Oh. Good. It's really good. All right. Let's try the scallop full of cheese and mayo. Oh, it's hot, 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 hot. Mm. Oh wow, it's so creamy and the sauce is very fresh, so it's a good combination of fresh and creamy. I think you like it. Now we're trying another staple of this market, crab and caramel with chili, you can see the whole chili. Mm. It's so crunchy. It's like so shell crab. When it's not, it's sweet. It's very delicious. All right, so for me not being much of a seafood eater, these are, uh, are gonna be a little bit interesting. I might be okay, I'll find out. Mm. Oh yeah. Tastes like pizza almost. Not bad. So next I'm gonna try one of these little mini crabs. I guess you just eat the whole thing. It doesn't taste like seafood, it tastes like candy. A little bit of seafood on the end. It's not bad though. I mean, for me not being a seafood eater, it's not bad. So lastly, I'm gonna try the fish ball, which is the most intimidating for me, not being a fish eater. Looks like there's some basil in there, so that might help. <laughs> All right, gonna give it a shot. Yeah, basil, lemongrass, very Thai. Okay, fresh from the grill, some crocodile meat with chili sauce. I don't understand this. It's like, it's spicy, but the taste itself is, is fish mixed with chicken. It's like dry chicken. Yeah, not bad. All right, I can't believe you convinced me to do this. I'm not as brave an eater as you are, but. Oh God. I don't like it. <sighs> well, I just stepped out to use the restroom and man, 
It's hot out here. It is so busy. There is so much going on. Very difficult to capture. We, we couldn't even really find a seat. I think we're sitting in the, like an aisle on a tiny little bench. I guess that's part of the experience here. Which is so weird. This is river prawns. Someone doesn't have any patience. I also want a hat. There's so much juice in the hat. People who don't eat shrimps, especially giant shrimps hats, you guys missing out. <laughs> If you don't spill at least one per meal, I'm impressed. <laughs> yes. Mm. song is your song mm -hmm. all right all right <laughs> so we just wrapped up our day at the amampa amampa floating market it's been hectic it's been loud it's been very hot basically like bangkok <laughs> like what you expect from the bangkok it was a lot of people a lot of locals we haven't seen a lot of tourists lots of food options every tasty wish mostly seafood related because they were right on the river there were lots of sweets yeah. which we haven't tried but yeah we have a cookie to go personally i learned a lot of lessons about shooting and filming especially around like big crowds this is one of the bigger crowds we've kind of had to navigate the market has all kinds of sights and smells lots of fishy smells we had some interesting food some fishy food to start with which didn't sit well for us but fortunately by the end of the day we found uh, a nice restaurant delicious prawns that was wonderful just a little bit tired from an exhausting but but great day so we'll get back to you though when we're back home so see you see you i'm gonna try this thing Hey guys, so we're back. It's about two days out since the Mpawa, Mpawa mar floating market. So after we cut, we ran into a little bit of trouble. We couldn't find a grab. It was an adventure for us. Anyways, for the past two days, we've been editing, trying to make our footage into something you know worth watching. You guys will be the judge of that. That's about it for our first vlog. Support our channel if you like the video. Please subscribe, like button, share with anyone. Thanks guys, and we'll see you on the next video. Bye. Bye.